Okay. So this is the Crossroads cinematic, which is going to be super spoilery. Let me also hide this. There we go. Um, yeah, this, so this is going to be super spoilery. So if you haven't if you haven't watched it and you don't want to watch it, you don't just be careful because uh, spoilery. I'm very excited. Uh, let me know if the volume's okay. It should be fine. Oh, so this is right after... to fail him like I failed his father. I wish I could change it all. Karen, Garrosh, Theramore. Sometimes it feels like I did everything wrong. We all have blood on our hands. And now, Sylvanas will come. Thunder Bluff will burn. Just like Tildrassil. Once before, you and I stood side by side on the slopes of Mount Hyjal. That world tree did not fall. Because the Horde and the Alliance worked together. Horde? Alliance? We've come to this crossroad again and again, Jaina. It always falls apart. What's different this time? We are. Oh my god! I should go. Anduin will want to know that Bane is safe. Tell your king. He is not alone. Ah! Ah, it's so good! That looks so good! It's so good! Oh my god. That was so good! You're the same recommended? Oh my god, that was so good, dude! I love seeing Jaina and Thrall standing together. Like, oh my, a new faction is totally going to be the people who follow Sylvanas. Do you think so? Like, they're going to have, like, so, a fa a th I don't think they'll ever introduce a third faction. But, like, it would be, so oh man. Oh man! Seeing Thrall and Jaina together and, like, ready to go. That was such a good line. That they, they like, the, what's changed. Like, what's going to happen? Thrall looks a lot younger, too, than he, like, has in the past. Warcraft 3 vibes. Yeah, 100%. And then, like, they're talking about... Oh, my God. It was so good. It was so good. Oh, my God. I loved it. I kind of want to watch it again. Can we watch it again? What did Jaina rescue them from? Or are you allowed to tell... The war campaign. Uh, So, during the war campaign, uh, Jaina takes... Or, um, uh, Sylvanas, you know, goes to rest Bane. Uh, Bane is being held uh, in basically where, like, Siege of Ogremar, like, underneath, underneath Ogremar. Um, and you go and rescue Bane with Jaina, uh, uh, what's his name? Um, the human SI7 guy, uh, Thrall, and Saurfang. I'll go and rescue Bane. It looks like they teleport out afterwards, um, which is super cool. Super cool. But, like... What if Sylvanas attacks Thunder Bluff? You don't fucking attack the Torrent. No! Shaw, thank you. Matthias Shaw. Uh, Thunder Bluff being attacked is gonna... There's no way. Would, would she attack Thunder Bluff? I don't know. I I don't know because I don't know if Jaina... I mean, if Sylvanas... I don't think Sylvanas will attack Thunder Bluff because I don't think that's her plan here. I don't think her plan was to... Was to, uh, was to ever kill... Ba I don't know! I don't think her plan was to kill Bane. I don't think her idea, her plan is to sack Thunder Bluff. I don't I think there's more to it. I 
I think there's more to it. Thrall thinks so. I don't know. I don't think she will. Thrall thinks so. Of course he does. I think everybody everybody that's seeing what happens, I think, I think has to think that Sylvanas is going to be a huge threat. But I think Sylvanas wants them to think she's a huge... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Because then the cinematic that came out yesterday when uh, Nathanos is going to... And he's, he knows that the ocean's going to open. He knows. he's he's He has Zalatef in his hands. He knows it's going to open up. Sylvanas knows. They all know. Why do they decide to do that? Is it simply to destroy the fleet? Because they know the Alliance has a bigger fleet? Like, what it... I, I don't know. I think there's just more to it. Very excited. Very excited to see what's going on. That was a, such a good... That was so good. Seeing Jaina and Thrall interact in any way, though, just gets me. I love it. I love it. That was so good. I kind of wanted to watch it again. 